this is a wonderful, fantastic technique, especially for the people who want to pursue a career in brand strategy. Even the brand owners should know this method. What is this for? Asking five time why fashion. This is a technique used by Toyota. This is a cause root finding methodology, but in advertising and branding, we use this to find out rational and emotional reasons why people buy certain products and services. For example, somebody bought the Apple Watch, okay? Ask them, why did they buy? The first why, why did they buy? You ask them, why did you buy? They'll tell you, hey, I have been planning to buy a watch and uh, then there was a discount, uh, so I happens to uh, end up buying the Apple Watch. So the reason is discount, okay? Again, the second why you can ask her that, hey, why did you wait for a discount to buy the watch? You could have bought it because you really like Apple Watch. Of course, I would have bought it like this. Money wasn't the reason. But anyway, I wanted to buy it whether there's discount or not. But what happened is that uh, I was just delaying for some time just because I was replacing my other Mac devices. I wanted to buy a bulk purchasing, my iPhone, MacBook, and watch at one occasion. Birthday coming, so I wanted to buy the three things and give myself. So that's the reason. And one advantage is uh, when I purchased this that time, there was 20% discount. Offer was going on a watch and score by. So the second question answer, what you understood is that this person is buy several Apple products. You can ask a third question around, hey, why did you buy Apple Watch without buying any digital watch? Why specifically Apple? Then she will tell you, hey, I, I love Apple as a brand. I love the philosophy and I have most of my gadgets of Apple. So buying any other digital watch never sync very well with other Apple products. So henceforth, it's a default. Like there is an ecosystem Apple has created. Buying a watch made more sense for me. So henceforth, I buy it. So her third answer why she bought Apple Watch because the Apple created this ecosystem. Now you can ask the fourth question. Hey, you could have gone for Samsung or any other brand, which they have your watches, they have phones, they have tablets or, or laptops. Why did you go for Apple? And now you listen to her answer. She might tell you that, no, no, I, I like Apple because the philosophy and uh, I'm a great admirer of Steve Jobs. And I wanted to be associated with Apple philosophy. And many of my colleagues have Apple, so Apple seemed much better bet for me because I'm part of that, not only ecosystem when I'm buying it, I'm part of my community, friends, and my, my colleagues. So the fourth answer, you got it, like she wanted to belong to the community. That's also a huge force for her to buy Apple products. Now you can ask them, why do you want to be part of this community? It could have been radical and different. She might say that, of course, I like being radical. But when I looked at other brands, only Apple seemed much more interesting. Beyond that, opening a laptop, IBM or Samsung, college or presentation, as a designer, it doesn't look design savvy. There is a soft corner for Apple as a designer. It's more of an emotional reason why I bought an Apple. If I calculate the amount of money I spent on Apple, I would have bought a two laptop with a similar performance. But still, I opted for Apple. I feel I belong to the community. So if you see, our fifth answer was more nuanced and much more emotionally connected.
So what happened when you ask the first why, she had given a rational reasons, 20% discount. When you ask the second question, hey, I wanted to buy the laptop, iPhone, and Apple Watch, but it's part of an ecosystem. Third question, she said that it seems she is part of that belongingness. The fourth, why not other brands? She advocated that Apple, Steve Jobs, what they are doing for design fraternity. The fifth, why she clearly articulated, even though financially or rationally it didn't make much sense, but in terms of belonging, cult, and being as a designer, it's uh, showing uh, gratitude to the design community. So the first three why answers were more of a rational reasons. The fourth and fifth answer the emotion or a deeper connection, deeper desires. So we use these rational and emotional aspects when we are creating communications or advertisements for brands. Therefore, if you see most of the time advertisements or or a brand communication, you see a huge portion where we use uh, emotional stories to connect with consumer. And at the same time, we run a tactical advertisement telling that, hey, there's a discount, there's an offer, these are time bond, buy within five days, we'll get a huge discount. So we use tactically rational reasons to make people take action, okay? then we use emotional reasons to connect them with the brand for years and years and years. So that's how, as a brand builder, we use rational and emotional reasons to communicate